Welcome to ADP Training, YouTube's automotive technology channel. In this channel, you'll learn all kinds of auto repair secrets, how your automobile works, and how to diagnose it. Hello everybody and welcome to another video. In today's video, we are going to talk about the uh, hardwire master flow sensor. <clears throat> uh, and as you can see on screen, uh, this is the, uh, the starting, uh, whenever we start the uh, uh, the oscilloscope, the eight-channel oscilloscope. We get the uh, we go into vehicle diagnostics and we go into sensors, and then there's uh, the third uh, icon in there is the uh, airflow meter, hot wire. Okay. <clears throat> now, this is what the signal should look like. Okay. Now, this signal it's uh, uh, it's a compound signal, pretty much. This this is a signal at wide open throttle. Okay. So this is a, a by, while goosing the accelerator to uh, the wide open throttle, okay? So as you can see here, wide open throttle, you let go. When you let go of the accelerator, it goes up and then decelerates, okay? So this is what it should look like, okay? Now, um, this signal, uh, and as you can see, we're going to post a, a short video of, from one of our libraries, you know, video libraries uh, of, of uh, how this sensor works. The hot wire mass airflow sensor is a device that measures incoming air by the amount of current flow needed to maintain a specific temperature across a hot platinum wire element. As the air enters the intake duct and cools down the hot wire element, the mass airflow sensor circuitry will increase or decrease the current needed to maintain that specific temperature. The change in current is then converted into a voltage signal which is then used by the ECM as a signal for airflow. Also remember that the voltage output signal produced by the hot wire mass airflow sensor is directly proportional to the amount of air entering the engine so that, as air flow increases, so does the voltage output of the sensor unit. There are various types of mass airflow sensors using the hot wire principle. In this photograph we see a mass airflow with multiple hot wire elements. Regardless of the type, they all work the same, which is by changing the current across the hot wire to maintain a specific temperature. Now, uh, back to the video. Uh, basically, what you're looking for is or is the uh, the reflex of the hot wire mass airflow sensor. The hot wire mass airflow sensor, uh, exactly as the name implies, you know, it it's a hot wire. Uh, it's made out of uh, titanium or um, I'm sorry, uh, platinum. Uh, so it's a little tiny wire that's made out of platinum. Uh, and so basically, what you uh, you know, there is a little circuit inside that. What it does is it looks at the uh, current needed to maintain a specific voltage uh, or temperature across that wire, which that's why it's called hot wire. Now, uh, once it, uh, it uh, depending on the flow of air, uh, basically this, this is what happens. So the more flow of air, the higher the voltage. Okay, so you can see over here. Okay, and then and then it goes. Uh, this is goose the throttle so wide open throttle and let go and so this is the reflex of letting go or letting go of the uh, uh, of the accelerator and then coming down so uh, as you can see the upper signal is the, uh, the 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 sample signal okay this is typical of this particular software uh, and the uh, down here we have uh, the actual uh, channel one of the of the scope okay so here we have we have the trigger up here. Let me see. And so, uh, and then we have the the trigger is also over here to to the side. I think it froze up for for the time being, but that's fine. Uh, basically, we're gonna. There you go. So this is this is the signal. Uh, it's a 20 hertz signal, so it's not really uh, the signal for the wide open throttle because we're not connected to a car. Uh, but uh, just to show you that um, 
the, the, the scope itself sets itself for whatever you're trying to do in this particular case. Up here it says airflow meter, hardwire. So all you gotta do is connect channel one uh, to the signal wire for the master of flow sensor, and that's it, pretty much. Uh, it, it's a pretty straightforward, um, I mean, this thing is incredible, you know, as far as the, uh, the, the software itself, you know. Uh, the hardware of the scope is fantastic, you know, you can get, uh, for, for the amount of money, we sell this on our website. What we do is we buy it in quantities, in bulk, from them, uh, from, from the company that makes it, and then uh, we actually... Uh, we beef it up uh, for automotive purposes. It's already made for automotive purposes, but we put extra diodes. So this should, should have been there in, to begin with, you know, but they didn't do it. So uh, we put uh, diodes and some capacitors in there to uh, uh, make it more suitable for automotive use, okay? Uh, and then so that's what we sell on our website. And then you can buy our, our, our unit uh, bundle with a bunch of different uh, uh, add-ons, and uh, we have a very nice ignition uh, probe uh, which is fantastic it's the best on the market pretty much uh, forget about pico none of that crap you know this is uh, this is 10 times cheaper and probably 10 times better uh, not because of anything it's going to do the same thing as a pico uh, but you know basically it's it's we would build the add-ons for for this particular units okay so pico doesn't do that so we have uh, current sensors, current probes that we can actually use with this. Uh, and we have the ignition probes also. We have, I mean, we have a lot uh, for the scope, okay? So anyhow, uh, thank you for tuning into our channel, ADP Training. Uh, basically, we, we do everything here for automotive uh, diagnostics, uh, for training people, uh, do-it-yourselfers, um, professional technicians uh, all over the world. Pretty much we have customers every, everywhere. Uh, so uh, we like you for you to look at the screen and f uh, at the bottom of the screen, outside the screen, you're going to see a, a little dollar sign. This is for you to, uh, if you want to give us some donations, uh, five bucks, whatever you can afford. Uh, we really appreciate it. Uh, also, the um, um, then you can become a member too of the channel uh, for five bucks a month, something like that, which is nice as peanuts, you know. And these videos are very, very expensive to produce, believe it or not. Uh, we have a bunch of software, you know, stuff that we have, you know, that we uh, we use for, you know, for the uh, for these purposes. So, uh, you know, it, it doesn't really uh, pay to do these things. It's just for us, uh, it does because we, you know, that this is what we do. Okay. Uh, but anyhow, we appreciate you uh, tuning into our channel, ADP Training, and thank you for watching. This channel is for do-it-yourselfers, as well as professional auto repair technicians. We present all the content using the latest CG animation techniques, on-hands video, and how-to, tips and techniques. We encourage you to subscribe to this channel now. Once subscribed, anytime we upload a new automotive tip, secret, or technology video, you will be notified. Finally, by subscribing, you will also be part of our weekly freebies. Yes, we're constantly giving away lots of free merchandise. Automotive Diagnostics and Publishing's Mandy Concepcion, the owner of this channel, is one of the most prolific auto technology authors on the web. At any moment in time, we may offer a free book, Kindle eBook, Android app, one of our own diagnostic equipment, or even auto repair software that runs on your PC. Subscribe now free of charge, learn lots of automotive technology secrets, and win free stuff. It doesn't get any better than that. Thanks for watching, and enjoy.